dear customer care mama we were talking about it. I was saying things that were left open where people can hide okay and sensitive parts of the building so with the amount of people that were breaking in um, these are the one of the things again because of my training none of these doors are ever allowed to be open okay so okay so one is locked Now I often find these wide open as well. So while they are, they may be because of safety, um, perhaps putting a key card reader or something, because this is where, well, like I said, I told you, there were so many strange people breaking in. I mean, people talking about the doors being opened. <sighs> you know. This is what I did to mine, okay? Because you know what used to happen? Kids that would go to the yoga studio would come and arbitrarily ring your bells. You want somewhere to hide? If you're a bad person? How many people can live, live in here? I mean, stay. None of these doors are ever left open in Canada. See, they lock, they, they start to lock. But there you go. So, only you, I'm, the reason I'm showing you this, doing this is because what happened to my walls? Now, these are outdoor walls. I maybe never cared for, um, but you know, some of the damage in my place appeared to be like this, suddenly, like bridging and pitting. So, it may have been imperfections that were always there, but based upon the explosion and the water damage, it brought it up. So, you know, the apartment may have never been perfect, but certainly after the event, it became less perfect, if you know what I mean. And of course, I had to start looking for uh, you know, things that I hadn't noticed before. Like, for instance, this. You see? Okay, here's the seventh floor, right? So, now obviously this was done, or has actually... So you can see the rippling is very strong here. And that's what happened. Now some of it, of course, has 